So I think we're going to try this. Worst case scenario, it doesn't go well. And I say, say la vie. And we move on with our lives. Right? And I do believe Blaze can shield once against Cradilly. So we can hopefully do that and then bring in the Pelipper. Hopefully. Uh, Cradilly into Kingdra. All right. Kingdra's pretty interesting. Shadow Kingdra, nonetheless. What I'm debating here is do we want to pivot out of this? And I kind of do, right? Like, I kind of want to get a shield here and then go, fine. Bring in something that... There's the Blaze... We found the Blaziken. <laughs> the Blaziken does exist. Upside is as promised. We do get to a Bulldoze before... Uh, they get to anything, and they're going to have to burn both of their shields now. Or, nope, they'll let it die. All right. Fair trade. Okay. Hmm. I guess we're still Cradillying. Maybe it's not correct to do this. Maybe we should uh, Pelipper it. It's going to be Azuka, isn't it? Yeah, it's Azuka. I could still go to Pelipper. The problem is I don't know how Pelipper kills this thing. The problem is they're playing very much like their back mon doesn't want to see this. This is such a bad shield. That's such a bad shield though. Oh, come on. Ugh, we overtapped. All right. Well, I think we lose on that overtap. Um, I can hurricane this, but nah, we lose on that overtap. The problem is we need the um, we need the energy to kill the Kingdra still, right? <sighs> Fuck. That was that was unfortunate. So, unfortunately, uh, I was correct that they would probably switch or try and catch. The problem was is that when they did that, I was slow to make a decision. And being slow to make the decision cost us the game. I could have switched right off. That would have been fine. Um, that would have given us time to get to a hurricane. Um, or I could have thrown a stone edge and that could have also won us the game. Either way, that one was on me. That was on reflexes in me, so... Uh, this is a pretty bad map. Okay, Kingdra again. I think this is fine as a Kingdra answer. We get to throw neutral ice punches. We resist the uh, dragon breaths. And Shadow Claws neutral. So we should be fairly able to chew through this. I don't think we have to be terribly worried about an Octazuka either. So, and an Outrage obviously is resisted. So I'm not worried about that damage. What I don't want... Oh, oh, I actually don't know. Did that... Did I see the uh, the drop there? I don't know if I saw the drop. We're going to a little extra energy so that we can threaten the lantern with a bulldoze here or there, but... Um, I don't love where we're at. Ah. Well, we don't get to put a, uh, a bulldoze into them, unfortunately, unless they're not counting. Unless they're not counting. Okay, they're counting. Um, but we should be able to handle it from here. Obviously, of the things that we wanted to go our way, of the things that we uh, wanted to go our way, this did. Uh, winning the lead here functionally wins us this game because uh, this is a full-ass RPS uh, matchup where we're going to be very unlikely to win if our Pokemon are in the wrong order, so. I'm still not shielding this. Uh, where are we at? Okay, swap is still not a thing. What I'm looking out for right now is uh, some kind of switch and snipe because we have to be aware that our remaining matchups are pretty bad, right? Like, 
if somehow the lantern gets uh on the pelipper here we're we're gonna lose this game uh i do have to respect a potential brave bird yep there it is okay and then we should be fine i can uh i can still throw a move at the lantern i i didn't throw my move there so now i don't know if credilly wins cmp over lantern i like to think you do but it's not gonna end up mattering okay ggs they kept it close they did all the things that they needed to do we just were a step ahead of them in most of those spots so we could actually anticipate and make some good decisions but good for us that we won the lead and managed to keep alignment the whole way What I don't want to see is that team in a different order. That team uh, with the Blaziken in the lead just runs us. Like, same same reason. They did have the, uh, you know. Dilly win a rank one Dilly win CMP by 0. 0.3. Well, mine's close to rank one, too. So, I'm real glad. If it had come down to that, we still could have, in theory, won. But it might have been really, really close. Right? It might have been really close. All right, Stewie. What you got for us? Stewie's got a Marsh Stomp lead. Oh, hey, it's that Marsh Stomp we talked about earlier. What is coming in? Okay. Hmm. So I know that that shield is a little bit unorthodox. But here's the thing. I was fairly confident they were going to Scald. Like, fairly, fairly, fairly confident. And I know they probably have Acid Spray in their repertoire too. So what I was hoping to do there was ensure that I shield a Scald. And not put myself in a position where I shield an Acid Spray accidentally. It might not matter if we shield an acid spray, although this defense drop, or sorry, attack drop is actually pretty bad because that. Like, literally, like. You know what? It's not worth it. Aha! Aha! <laughs> Um, even if, even if they had gone a different route, I don't, I don't think it's worth it there to, uh, okay. I mean, we're going to, we're just going to go back to Cradilly. Like this isn't the best matchup. They actually can do neutral damage to us with a couple pretty good moves, but like they might have another grass counter in the back. And depending on what that other grass counter is, we probably want the Pelip or fighting it, right? Uh, I think we stay and do as much damage as we can. Uh, we also might be, might want to be stone edging here, but I think we just stay in here. I think we shield this. There's the sludge wave. Okay, we hurricane this, and then the Marsh Stomp doesn't have anything to throw at us that does neutral damage. Right? Unless I guess they unless they have uh, is it gunk? It's not even gunk shot. It's just regular 
or sludge. Sorry, sorry, sludge. <laughs> I guess they could sludge us. Do it? It won't kill me. Yeah, it's sludge. <laughs> they do have it. Um, problem, sludge is awful. It's a terrible move. It's not sludge wave like like Swampert has. It's sludge and sludge is bad. It's pretty much never correct to run sludge, I don't think. It just does nothing. Yeah, it's non-stab and it's a bad move. So yeah, it lets you hit the Pelipper for damage. Like if the Pelipper was almost dead, but at that point, just Surf. <laughs> surf is probably better. Marowak. Okay. Real talk. It's, a, it's not a terrible matchup for us. I'm going to go ahead and just straight Stone Edge. It does th it, it does almost the same amount of damage. Jesus Christ. Uh, that's incredible. I think we uh we're we're just gonna we're gonna end up letting this go. They're gonna be empty on energy. And we're just gonna go ahead and hope that our back line can handle handle this, right? Show me what you got back here. Cradilly, all right. We're gonna do something silly. <laughs> We're gonna do something silly here. I'm well aware that this isn't probably statistically the correct play, but it feels like the correct play. <laughs> ah, wish cash. Well, shit. I mean, this isn't this isn't the end of the world. So that Cordilli has a lot of energy. Like worth noting, it's got a good chunk of energy. So we do have to be somewhat aware of the fact that that can probably finish off the, uh, it can finish off the, uh, the Pelipper. But this thing needs, uh, a lot going for it here. It needs to land a blizzard or get a shield. And I think what we do here is we just say like, all right, you know what? Buddy, if you got the blizzard here, I think we just lose no matter what. So you did. Okay, good for you. Actually, that's not even true. If they, uh, if they don't have stacked moves here, I think they have two grass knots, but also we overtapped. But I think we win CMP, so I think we're going to win this game anyway. Because I have two moves. And they should die to a uh, a weather ball here. GG. We got it. I, I like I think all the all of those decisions were kind of made for us, right? It was like we did. We put ourselves in the best position to win that game as possible. And uh, it worked out for us. GG's. Luckily, the back line wasn't particularly good against uh, against Pelipper. It's actually quite bad against it. That team is actually quite bad against Pelipper. It's the Humber Taker. That's a great name. Great name. Uh, Cradilly Pelipper. Yeah, fine. I mean, obviously, we know kind of how this goes. They're probably weatherballing me, though. The question is, uh, I mean, if I can get a shield out of them, 
I will probably switch to Sand Slash and see if I can make kind of a something happen here, right? Bait out whatever their Sand Slash counter is, because there probably is one, right? And if not, I've got a great run and start here. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Pelipper's got good energy stored, so we have to keep that in mind. I don't want to uh, put myself in a position, but curious that this came out. I wonder if their backmon is a grass type. They have to earthquake me here or I don't die, so I'm not shielding. Oh. Yeah, you know what? Nah. Nah. Keep those shields. Hmm. Weather ball or hurricane? Yeah, you know what? Weather ball me. Do it. Do it. I will shield this one. Because I do have a... I do have a... Uh, a move to throw here that I think is worth throwing sand slash in the back all right well the good news is we threw the right move the bad news is we have to play that same Pelipper matchup that I opted for earlier ice punch me it's fine do it do it Try and manage our energy really well so we can go into this Pelipper mirror coming up with uh, a chance. Well, we have to shield this. I do think I threw a move, though, and that's not great. I think we see impede on this. So I might need to undercharge this. No, okay. I didn't throw. I don't know if their Pelipper has a move right off. I think we're one wing attack away anyway from a weather ball. Also, a weather ball won't kill him, so... Oh! I think it's correct there to go for that, but unfortunately, we were literally one short. I needed to... Uh, I needed to do something slightly different there. Rip. Or we needed to protect the Cradilly a little, mo a little more. Or keep that energy, right? Close. Well played. Good uh, neutral play in mirrors. And you know what? We walk out of the set with three wins, and I'm pretty happy about that, given how the day is gone.